morning, Tigers. We still have our balloon friend today. We're gonna to continue using it for today's lesson. So before we get into that, I just wanna remind you boys and girls, we are tiger strong. We need to get out every day and move our bodies. The best way to stay healthy is to have a healthy body. The way we have healthy bodies is by getting out every day and moving, exercise, getting our heart rates up. So I just wanted to encourage you boys and girls, we want to stay tiger strong. You can do this. We can do this together. All right. So our objective today is to volley a balloon or a ball. Um, we were doing striking earlier and we were using a balloon. Where'd my balloon go? There it went. We're using our balloon and volley is when you're using the balloon or a ball for volleyball. You can use a balloon, you can use a beach ball. If you have a volleyball at home, you can use a volleyball. Oh, soccer ball, basketballs, those are gonna hurt. Um, so you don't wanna use those to try this lesson or to do this lesson, but you do wanna use something that isn't causing pain on your arms. So um, let me go over, let me go over the body positioning for bumping a ball. All right, so we're talking about volleyball now. When you bump a ball, you need to get your body into this kind of position. One foot forward, you're balanced. I'm gonna put my balloon down. Okay, your feet are spread apart, you're balanced. You have, your dominant leg is forward. For me, that's my left leg. For some of you, that might be your right leg. That feels really funny for me. So I'm gonna get myself into this position. When you volley a ball, your arms are straight. You want to make sure your elbows are not bent. You're not doing this, okay? So your arms are straight. You're not going to hit the ball with your hands. You're hitting the ball or balloon in the space between your wrist and your elbows, all right? So this week, what you're going to focus on is taking that balloon you've been using for your striking lessons getting underneath it. Look at how I'm bending my knees. Just like striking, I gotta keep my eye on the ball, and if it moves away from me, move to it. So I'm hitting my balloon. Oops, I hit it on my hands, and that's why it went so far away from me. So it's so important that you're hitting the ball here. Again, bending down and moving to it as it moves away. That's the skill I want you to work on this week. You could use a volleyball. I've got one here. Okay, it's gonna feel a little bit different. Again, you've gotta keep those arms straight and move to the ball. All right, our fitness focus. We're continuing with planks. We're building up our muscle, muscular strength. Let me go over to my board so you can see what I'm talking about. Muscular strength and muscular endurance. Muscular strength means you have the ability to hold your body up. You don't fall to the ground. Muscular endurance means how long can you do that? So again, I'm gonna get down into position. Um, this is a plank also. So I'm gonna offer this as an alternative way to hold your plank. I don't know if it's easier or harder, so you decide. But again, when you're doing a plank, don't look at your feet and don't look up, just look straight down. My feet are together, okay? I find having them together so I can support my ankles, that's, it gives me more support. You don't want them spread out like that. Remember the other way you can do a plank is what I've been showing you, again, you want to keep your spine straight, so you're looking straight down and your body is flat. You don't want to collapse. You don't want to go up high. One of the ways that I'm keeping my body flat is I'm squeezing my gluteus maximus or tightening it, and I'm pushing my belly button up towards the ceiling. So you have to tighten your core muscles. You have to tighten your gluteus maximus. If you don't tighten those muscles, those are the muscles we're working on, if you don't tighten them, which means squeeze them, then your body's going to collapse and you're going to have that bathtub, okay? Health focus, eating fresh fruits and veggies. 
Boys and girls, when you're at home, ask your parents to stock up on the apples and the oranges and the pears, carrots, celery. Eat a lot of fresh fruits and veggies when you're snacking. Don't grab the chips. Don't grab the bagels. Don't grab the frozen pizzas. Eat as many fresh fruits and vegetables. That helps eliminate the waste from your body, helps keep your teeth clean, and it's just good for your body, a good way to stay healthy. All right, so your activity this week will be bumping with the ball or balloon with control. So just what I was showing you early, getting under it, I need to see that good control. And remember, every assignment, I am watching your videos that you send me and you get a score, 0, 25, 50, or 100. And that, how you get those scores are in the rubric with your assignment. So boys and girls, have fun playing volleyball, learning the basics. And the next video, we're gonna take it a little bit further. Have fun.